What's going on ladies and gents? It's Salvaje. So I'm back at it again with another Anthem Minute. You know, the series where I get straight to the point on Anthem News. Okay, so I haven't been doing a lot of Anthem Minutes lately because I've been working on guides, etc, etc. But this is definitely a video worth doing. So the 90 day content plan for Anthem has been revealed. Let's take a look at it. We have the recurring updates, basically the updates that we got, you know, pretty uh, simple. We got Outlaw Art Rage. We got that one day before the full release. We got Therapy Giants. I'll probably be having a guide on that pretty soon. Um, and then we have a free play event coming uh, probably when this event is going to be done, which is in about two days, I believe, called Shaper Surge. So that's pretty cool. So far, my thoughts on free play events is that they are pretty basic at the moment. Okay, so the giant, for example, they gave you a vinyl. Maybe the Shaper Surge sort of gives you a new color for your javelin, etc., etc. I do hope, however, that these free play events sort of evolve over time and um, they give uh, pretty awesome stuff. Like, for example, maybe a guaranteed masterwork if you complete the free play event or a guaranteed legendary if you do it on Grandmaster 3, for example. We have the Elysian Stronghold caches uh, coming soon. And uh, this is probably going to be the vanity items that are going to be added to specific strongholds. I cannot wait for that and I cannot wait to see the uh, specific emotes uh, in the game myself uh, when I get them because there are going to be new vanity emotes added to strongholds. We have new items coming in March 2019 as well. This is something that is pretty awesome. Hopefully we can get some items for the interceptor that can uh, prime and detonate a couple of more targets. Legendary missions phase one. So here's the uh, game plan behind legendary missions. Uh, they did say on a live stream that Legendary missions are going to be sort of the second thing that rewards you the most in Anthem. So that's pretty cool. And they also did say that if players really like legendary missions, they're going to basically make every mission in the game playable. So that is, of course, pretty cool. We got a free play event coming in March that's locked. We got Therapy Giants. We got Outlaw Outrage. And then, of course, we have another free play event coming towards the end of March 2019. That is also going to be locked at the moment. April 2019. Expanded progression to the mastery system. So maybe this means that we're getting another Grandmaster difficulty. Uh, I actually wouldn't be, um, you know, I, I, I'm not going to be pissed about that um, because I'm, I'm already about to head into a Grandmaster 2 with my Interceptor and uh, my Colossus, my Ranger, and my Storm are almost right behind them as well. We got new items coming in the brand new uh, mastery system. That's pretty cool. We got a couple of free play events, you know, sort of locked uh, at the moment in April 2019. And I'm guessing these uh, free play events that we're going to be having are going to be helping us probably expand our progression a little bit. And the reason for that is because as you guys can see, we have a lot of free play events. However, keep in mind, some of these events, of course, might actually change. Legendary missions phase two towards the end of April. That sounds good. I can't wait to get my hands on legendary missions. I cannot wait to do this new stronghold called the Sunken. I'm really looking forward to that one. And then, of course, we have the weekly stronghold challenge that's going to be coming out on April 2019. I'm looking forward to this. I ha I've been having a blast doing Grandmaster 1 and Grandmaster 2 strongholds. And uh, yeah, I cannot wait to do more. We have leaderboards. I can't wait to have leaderboards. I'm probably going to be the best interceptor on the game because uh, I'm really good with the interceptor guys. And we have guilds coming in on, again, April 2019. So make sure that um, y'all stay subscribed to the channel so y'all can join my guild. I'm just saying, my guild's going to be lit. May 2019, the Cataclysm starts, and apparently the Cataclysm is going to be changing everything in Anthem. And of course, we're going to be getting uh, a lot of uh, things. As of, you know, like Bioware said, aspirational content, like Ray-type content, comes from the Cataclysm. So I can't wait. We have a free play event, you know, locked. We have new missions coming into the game on May 2019. I'm really looking forward to that. And of course, we also have new items and that's pretty much it when it comes down to the 90 day roadmap when it comes down to anthem overall i'm looking forward to it and as a fellow looter shooter veteran i like what i'm seeing so far the number one thing that i like that i'm seeing is the new items added into the game 
because new items means more builds, more builds means more variety, more variety means more replay value and just, you know, more fun that you're going to be having with the game. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and of course feel free to subscribe and check out my 100 tips video on Anthem in the description below.